All right, weight and balance is uh, pretty much completed now. My weight, what I got was 923 pounds. And uh, that seems about pretty average for this configuration. Is they use the, uh, the datum as the leading edge of the wing here on, in the Zenith uh, plans. So you get a plumb, a plumb bob, hang straight down here, measure from here, and find the arm to the middle of the main tire on both sides. Figure out what that is. Uh, mine came out to 25.5 or 25 and a half inches. And uh, they were like a quarter inch off either, both directions. So I averaged about 25.5 on that distance. And then you have to subtract the arm from the datum line, which is on my blue tape, going to the, uh, the middle of the nose wheel. And for me, that came out to 30.75 inches. But uh, this part's done. Uh, start putting some fuel in this, run the engine, make sure the engine still runs. I never ran the engine with the prop on it yet. So uh, we're gonna see how all that works out do some uh, engine runs, that type of thing. As long as all that looks good, I'll get all my paperwork squared, send it for the inspector. I'm gonna attempt to call the Mito office and see, cause they're an all-in-one shop, is my understanding, that I can get my airworthiness and my repairman from the Mito shop, uh, as opposed to the uh, FISDO. And then getting a DAR, they can, sure, they can do the airworthiness, and then you're paying them thousands of dollars and still have to go back to the Mito for the repairman is my understanding. So if I can just use the Mito here in, uh, or I think it's Orlando, we'll see what we can do. Talk to you soon.